Hello everybody, welcome or welcome back to El Cuisine. I hope you're all doing well. Today we are going to prepare cabbage minced soup. This is a very quick recipe again and um, perfectly for this time of the year, this cold time of the year. Do kindly check down below in the description box what you need, the amount and how it should be sliced into. Okay, here we go. Add approximately three tablespoons of vegetable oil in your saucepan. Crushed your garlic, you, if you prefer one. Add your diced onions as well as your ginger. You may lower your stove to medium heat and allow the ingredients you just added, you know, to process. Um, as you can see, I had mine way too high. But anyways, you may add your minced meat. Now allow your minced meat to cook for like five more minutes and you may add all your seasonings. So I added two bay leaves and half teaspoon of black pepper, juniper berries, marjoram and caraway seeds. Now you stir everything and then you subsequently add the cabbage you've cut into stripes earlier on. Now the goal is to braise everything, um, however at some point I did add a bit of water just you know to give, um, yeah, to add some liquid into the whole process. Um, I have to admit this soup was quite a lot. Um, I cooked for four people and we had enough for the next day as well. So now if you noticed I did not add any salt earlier on because I knew that I'm gonna add veg vegetable broth here. Um, so I added five teaspoons of vegetable broth and then I stir it. Alternatively, you can add that into water and you know, just add onto it. Now I let the cabbage cook for approximately eight minutes before I added my carrots. And I also let the carrot cook for five minutes and then I added my potatoes onto it. Now add the amount of water you prefer and please make sure that the water is actually you know boiling already so that doesn't slow down your cooking process and then yeah you stir it and you make it you let everything cook for 15 minutes again. I did add a pinch of salt onto it because you know just for me to taste how I prefer it you may leave it out just adjust it according to your taste um, also at this point the amount of water you really add to your soup depends on the consistency you wish your soup to be some prefer it to be thick others prefer it to be more watery um, I like somewhere in between so that's what I went for at the end I just sliced a bunch of parsley and I added onto it I did also add some nutmeg just to introduce more flavor and then you are ready to enjoy your soup I hope you guys enjoyed this video as I did and if yes kindly leave a thumb up and please subscribe to this channel 
and yeah see you around next time thank you very much bye